Jeb Blunt Objections, The Ultimate Guide for Mastering the Art and Science of Getting Past No. Are you ready to become the sales maestro that elegantly navigates past objections and closes impressive deals? Look no further. In Objections, The Ultimate Guide for Mastering the Art and Science of Getting Past No, Jeb Blunt delves into the challenges and frustrations faced by salespeople and equips you with inventive methods for tackling objections that come your way. Get prepared to transform your mindset, learn effective techniques to anticipate and respond to prospecting objections, handle red herrings, achieve micro-commitments, and lead your clients to the ultimate commitment. Embark on this enlightening journey and develop the practical skills to level up your sales game. Understanding Prospective Clients in Sales As a salesperson, it can be frustrating to be left with vague excuses from a prospective client after multiple presentations, especially when you're near the finish line. However, these situations arise due to a lack of trust from past experiences which makes clients hesitant to be specific about their concerns. Arguing with a doubtful prospect only heightens their resistance and reinforces their belief that they're right. Therefore, it is crucial to adopt a more effective approach to address a prospect's doubts to make the sale. Turning prospecting objections into success. Making cold calls or visiting prospects can be daunting. People's initial response is often negative, but by understanding the limited reasons for rejection and preparing answers in advance, you can turn these objections into meaningful interactions that could lead to sales. Sales teams need to analyze the reasons prospects give for not engaging and find that many of these are the same issues expressed differently. By anticipating the most common prospecting objections and scripting answers in advance, sales teams can avoid cliches and disrupt prospects' expectations, increasing the likelihood of engagement and continuing conversations. How to Avoid Red Herring Objections in Sales Conversations Sales representatives often encounter red herring objections that steer the conversation away from the intended objective. By using the pious technique, pausing, acknowledging, ignoring, and saving, representatives can address these objections without compromising their focus or confidence. For example, when asked about pricing, Derek could have paused to collect his thoughts, acknowledged the objection, tactfully ignored it, and saved it for later in the process. This approach prevents the conversation from unraveling and helps representatives achieve their main goal. Micro-commitment, the key to sales success. A micro-commitment is a small but important next step that a salesperson and a prospect agree on before their conversation ends. Agreeing on a specific action and a fixed date for reviewing those actions is crucial to make a sale. The book also explains how to turn micro-commitment objections around by showing the prospect the value of a proposed action and asking for their commitment again. Overcoming Late-Stage Sales Objections In this book, the author provides a five-step process to turn late-stage sales objections around. When faced with buying objections, you should relate to the buyer, clarify their objection, address their true problem, minimize their doubt, and ask for the deal again. However, if you cannot overcome the objection, you may need to adopt a fallback position. The Power of Asking Sales professionals need to conquer their fear of rejection and start asking for what they want to be successful. The number one hindrance to their advancement is their reluctance to ask. Salespeople must request time, information, or money from potential customers, and the reluctance to do so is due to a fear of rejection. Vulnerability and rejection are unavoidable for top salespeople, but their ability to ask repeatedly distinguishes them from others. The power of saying no. Rejection is an inevitable part of sales and life in general. Even the most successful individuals faced countless rejections before achieving their goals. This summary shares the stories of Stephen King and Colonel Sanders, who persevered through numerous no's to reach the top of their respective fields. Rather than letting rejection hold you back, it's essential to turn it into fuel for success. Don't be afraid of objections and rejection, instead, use them as motivation to keep searching for that yes. The road to success is long and filled with obstacles, 
but those who persist will eventually reap the rewards. Having explored the core teachings summarized from Jeb Blunt's insightful book, you're now well equipped to face the inevitable objections that sales scenarios throw at you. Embrace prospecting objections by preparing scripts, and utilize the pious technique to manage red herrings. Don't forget the significance of micro-commitments and learn the five-step process to overcome last-minute buying objections. By adopting the crucial lessons of courage and persistence from the inspiring stories like Stephen King and Colonel Sanders, you can turn your rejections into opportunities to succeed. Remember, no matter how many no's come your way, staying determined and resilient will lead you to that golden yes.